So I'm Oscar Warner, I'm president of Toby Tech. I'm going to do an um, uh, intro here of eye tracking. Uh, I'm going to show you the world's first gaze enabled laptop, the MSI GT72. I'm going to show you Windows Hello login, uh, controlling your uh, Windows device via I by, with your eyes. I'm also going to show you a couple of games. Uh, so I'm going to show you Assassin's Creed Syndicate with eye tracking and a mod for Grand Theft Auto, Grand Theft Auto 5. So the first thing we'll show is just the login with, uh, with, uh, <laughs> with Windows Hello, and that's actually it. I just looked at the device and I logged in. I can do it one more time, so I locked the device. Now, if I just look it and press the spacebar, boom, and I'm logged in. So then the next thing I'm going to show you is how you can control your computer with your eyes. Um, so this is uh, Toby software, so I'm doing Alt-Tab here, the normal Alt-Tab. And if you see, if I'm just looking at the different icons, they're, they are now highlighted with my eyes, and I select whatever I'm looking at, whatever I'm looking at. So I just do Alt Tab as normal, and then I look at the icon that I want to that I want to select, and then I then I go there. So let's go back to the to the screen. I also have a feature which is uh, mouse pointing. So if I look at the recycle bin there, and I just place my finger on the touchpad, my mouse cursor will jump there. If I look at Google Chrome, I look at I look at the icon, place my mouse cursor, and go, there we go. I look at Assassin's Creed, again. I look at GTA 5, Recycle Bin, Chrome. So again, this removes the need uh, to scroll around on the touchpad. So this is on the Toby IX webpage. So I look at products. I place my finger on the touchpad. I go there. I make a small adjustment. I release, and then I select. I look at support, place my finger on the touchpad, it goes there automatically, release, and I touched, and I go there. So I no longer need to use my touchpad to select. I can only look at the thing, the thing knows that I'm looking at it, and I press a button and I select it. So this is all there if you, if you either purchase the MSI GT72, that's a gaming laptop, launched now, it's um, uh, being shipped in the US in the mid-January, or you can buy a Toby IX controller, uh, which is basically this one, it's $129 uh, on the internet, basically. And you get all of this included. Uh, well, that's not all. Um, you can also play games with it. So we just announced uh, that Assassin's Creed Syndicate will implement eye tracking. So I'm going to show you how, how that works. So here I am in the game. So now suddenly I have the rope launcher, which is one of the signature features of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. I usually need to turn my character in order to aim where I'm going, but I no longer need to do that. So here I'm just looking at different points here, and when I'm looking at the different points, that's the options I have to go. So again, I'm just exploring here with my eyes the natural thing I do in real life. If I then press the left bumper button, I go there automatically. If I want to go back, I'm exploring here. Again, the options I have to move. Just looking at the different options where I want to where I want to go and shoot. It's a very natural thing, and it's only replicating what we already do in real life. Basically, if you want to look around, we look around, we explore with our eyes. We don't explore by controlling by by chain, by, by by turning the scene camera. We explore by looking at the things with our eyes. So there I go, I look and I go. I can also show you another game. This is Assassin's. This is Grand Theft Auto. Uh, it's a mod, so it's not integrated into, into the normal game. So this is a mod we done for, or the mod that is done for Grand Theft Auto, a free mod uh, open on the community. I would uh, go out and I can just look at an area. So I look at the car right in front of me and I press a button and I shoot it. I look at the car over there and I press a button and I shoot it. So again, this just shows you how natural targeting is with your eyes because that is what you're used to doing. Every time you pick up something in real life, you have targeted that with, with your eyes. Every time you throw something, you target with your eyes. I'm not a super good GTA player, but then now you see it's a marker here. You see I'm marking this car with, when I'm looking at it with my eyes, so I can drive and shoot at the same time. So I'm driving, looking at the car, shoot it. So this gives me an, an, an option that I didn't have before, because I can, I can 
control things in two directions at once. I'm using my hands just as normal to control the car while I'm driving, and then I'm looking at it in a different, different direction and shooting with my eyes. So here, I can shoot in that direction with my eyes by just looking at the different cars, also while driving. Last feature that I'm going to show if I go out is the weapon selection menu. So basically I stand here, I want to switch weapons. I just press a button, look at the weapon that I want to select and release. Again, look at the weapon, press a button, look at a weapon and release. Here is the Toby IS-4 or, or IS-3 that is um, the peripheral that, that is out right now, which is in the Toby IX or Toby SteelSeries or SteelSeries Sentry. So that is the current generation, the size of the technology, and this is the next generation. So you see the size difference. Now this is based for monitors and this for integration. But you see the power of the the the, the cost the, the reduction in size is also cost down. What we also done here was we have done the world's first eye tracking chip, the Toby eye chip. Then we have, um, this is a, pro I showed the GTA 72 from, from MSI, which is live shipping in January. That is the world's first gaze-enabled gaze laptop, which is out, out now and launched. Uh, here I'm showing a prototype of, with the next generation eye tracking integrated. So it's made by a Taiwanese ODM Inventec. So they integrated an eye tracking in the bottom here. And you see how slim it can become right now. So this is now a fully functional, gaze-enabled laptop. It has Windows Hello, it has all the features that are showed here for Windows Control, and it you can also play all the games that we have here. So it's around about 30 games that are available right now, and all those can be played on both those laptops, basically.